Welcome to Java Forum. Now we are going to see how to install and configure Windows Server 2019 on VMware Workstation 16. So first I am creating a new virtual machine, selecting installer image disk as a Windows Server 2019 ISO file which I already downloaded from uh, Microsoft website. So you can see that Windows Server 2019 is detected. So I will install this operating system later. Click the next button. From the drop down select Microsoft Windows. Uh, Windows Server 2019 is selected. Next I am giving one name to virtual machine. Next I am allocating some space to this uh, virtual hard drive and store it in uh, stored as a single file. Next, I am going to customize the hardware. So I am going to increase the memory. Also I am going to allocate some CPU cores. So on this virtualization engine parameters are optional. If you want, you can uh, enable it. And DVD, once again I am selecting Windows Server 2019 ISO file. So in order to get ISO file, uh, you need to register with Microsoft website. And it will be available for a trial. Network adapter will be NAT, so that it will be connected to the internet. So these are the settings for Windows Server 2019 virtual machine. So let me power on this virtual machine. Yes. So here you can see that uh, it is asking for a software update that is uh, VMware tools for Windows will be installed now. So download and install it. So this is very, very mandatory. So this will be uh, download and install uh, only one time. That is when VMware is used for first time, it will be installed. So once again, I am rebooting. So press any key to boot from uh, DVD. So now you can see that Windows Server 2019 installation screen has arrived. So English will be the default language. So click the install now button. So I am going to choose Windows Server 2019 uh, data center with the desktop experience. Click the next button. Accept the license agreement. I am choosing the custom install. Custom install, yes. So now uh, I am going to create one new drive, only single drive only I am going to create. So I am going to use all the space. Yes, you can see that uh, C drive is created. So some space are allocated to recovery and system, etc. So now installation is started. It will take some time, depends upon your computer speed and internet speed. So installation is uh, completed. I am rebooting the Windows Server 2019 virtual machine. Make sure that you are connected to the internet. So I am giving the administrator username and password. Finish. So send alt control delete. Send alt control delete. So now login as administrator.
yes so i logged in successfully so network click the x by s button so that uh, it will detect the network so you can see that screen resolution is not adjusted automatically which means vmware tools are not installed so let me check the display settings so this is the default resolution oh <laughs> so if vmware tools not installed means so screen will go like this don't worry it will uh, it will be back automatically okay so let us install the vmware tools for uh, windows now so go to the menu vm install vmware tools so you can see that uh, new dvd drive so vmware tools will be got inserted in dvd yes click the next button choose complete so i am choosing the complete installation of vmware tools click next button click install yes so during installation itself you can see that screen resolution is getting adjusted automatically so vmware tool setup is completed let me reboot the windows server 2019 virtual machine so you can see that after reboot uh, screen resolution is got adjusted automatically according my according to my monitor screen resolution so now i am going to check two features copy paste and uh, drag and drop so two features i am going to check now so i am opening our notepad so i am going to type some text in windows server 2019 vm and i'm going to copy this and paste in windows host machine so windows to windows it will be fine yes it's working next from windows host i am typing some text and i'm going to po uh, copy and paste to uh, windows server 2019 virtual machine copy paste it yes so copy paste is working between host and virtual machine and virtual machine to host also it's working so next i am going to check drag and drop feature i am going to drag and drop one file to windows server 2019 desktop let me drag on file yes so i can able to drag and drop one file you can see that uh, file is copied successfully to the desktop so windows server 2019 installation on vmware workstation 16 pro is successful make sure that you are connected to internet and install the vmware tools for windows